Peggy 12. All right, so last year, Ubisoft introduced a loud, fast, next-gen take on driving games. An MMO with the entirety of the United States, sea to shining sea, available to explore, along with every car customization imaginable so that you can road trip in style. The USA, coast to coast, without one single loading. True, expansive, open-world driving mayhem. Take a look at the crew. Clearly the scenery is gorgeous and the map is gigantic, but it's what you get to do in that map that makes this game so incredibly fun. And to tell us more, please welcome back to E3, creative director of The Crew, Julian Garrity. Hey, Julian. Hey. Hi, how are you? How's it going? I guess I'm gonna I'm, hug you. Oh. I'm a hugger, yes. All right, so tell us what's new with The Crew. I'm really excited about this. So, things have been crazy busy. We've been hard at work improving every facet of the game and pushing what makes our game really unique. Mm -hmm. The road trip you just saw there, that's just one of our two-hour-plus missions that will take you from Miami to LA by the way of New York, the Rockies, Las Vegas, and San Francisco. Cool. A little out of the way, but really cool. Now, I hear that you've actually been opening up the doors to the studio. Yes, yes. We've been striving to put the gamers at the heart of our experience. So we've given extended access to the game to members of our community and driving fanatics. It's helping us get some perspective on what works, what needs some love, and what everyone thinks is awesome. The community is also inspiring new gameplay. Players were improvising challenges. For example, meeting at the foot of one of our snow-capped mountains and racing to the top in an off-road kitted vehicle. And so, the hill climb skill was born. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, but you actually you did work outside of the studio as, right, as well, right? Of course. Okay. That, that version, mm -hmm. we let it out into the wild. Since mid-May, we launched an operation called Route 909, and we allow players in seven locations worldwide, from Montreal to Dubai and Los Angeles, to come and play the game and compete between crews on various challenges. The challenges range from cooperative races to exploration and even customization. And the feedback has been amazing. People have been blown away by the ambition, scale, and variety of gameplay. 
The finals are yet to happen. Currently, the two top teams are New York, who are at the top of the leaderboards, and Copenhagen, who have an unbreakable Viking spirit. But my money is on the Brazilian crew. Tune in to the Crew Battle Playoffs on Twitch, June 10th and 11th. Okay, well, you see this footage and you're dying to play. I'm dying to get my hands on this game. When can I do that? You're in the right place. Okay, good. We have four different demos at E3. On Sony's booth, Microsoft, NVIDIA, but if you want the real experience, uh, come to Ubisoft's booth. Mm -hmm. We have two motion seats. Oh, wow. Oh, and that's nice. not all. For everyone who isn't at E3, we're opening our closed beta July 23rd. But you can register right now on the crew Game.com. Awesome. Uh, obviously, we're all going to do that right away. I'm also just going to point out that you say beta in the most adorable way. Um, <laughs> super cute. I want to do the beta even more now. <laughs> so <laughs> tell me, I have one last question. It's the one that everybody's obviously been asking. What's the launch date for the crew? November 11th on PS4, Xbox One, and PC. Rock and roll. Thank you. Awesome. <laughs> Give it up for Julie and Gary, you guys. Yes.